And this is a frame na microfile material. Okay, so I'm going to work on this today. So it's still planted in a flower pot and, and the roots are already escaping. Okay, so I, let's see in Okay, let's focus more on the trunk so that is one feature we have a trunk a previously carved so for now this is its position so we'll be removing the old wire and putting on the new ones we'll do first is to remove the existing wire remove the existing wire here and then then the next thing to do is to cut those branches which are already thick enough okay, usually we cut the ones Growing at the top. So, okay. Okay. The rest of the bran branches which are still thin, this one, we we do not cut and allow it to grow further. Okay. This one is. Use useless branch. Okay, this one I will not cut for now. Also, this one. Then this branch I will not cut this branch yet because this can be used to this portion and at the same time thicken this uh, lowest branch. This is the lowest branch. We need a thick one here. So this will help thicken this part here. Okay, so the next thing to do is to wire. Okay, the next thing to do is to to wire the branches. And the important thing to wire here is this branch and this branch. Okay, so we wire that because you usually start from the bottom. And I anchor my wire here and wire this larger branch. Okay. And then this branch wire so that you can reach this part. Now you will notice that some branches are wired and others aren't. So these branches I wired this, this, and you will notice that, for example, in this branch. Let me see if you can see this. Okay. okay. These branches which are not cut are to be thickened yet so I did not cut this branch because this has to thicken while this while these branches which are already thick enough are expected to grow uh, twigs there okay and they will form this apex here while these branches these branches are still to be thickened so like this one and you will notice that uh, wiring the branch and in the end I have let it go up so basically also this one you let this go up this will not be used this branches will not be used this tip will not be used but they are still retained because we'd like to thicken this and hopefully this will become thicker like this or a little bit more 
because these are the lower branches. So this one also is uh, will eventually thicken as this uh, build new new branches also. So there are branches which we do not need. So for example, this one we do not need this because we just like to have this thickened and this will be the branch that will ramify this will be actually this is this is the front this will be replanted like this but uh, this is still allowed to grow because it might be used in the future so this one also this this branch is not needed see only this branch So that's how I work with this. But uh, with this, I'm still thickening the the some of the branches. So I think we need a bigger part so that. But I am cutting now the roots, or I will just let this escape so that uh, growing large root, roots will also help thicken this. Then we will uh, once this structures. These branch structures are thick enough, and we will be we will transfer this to a bonsai pot, wherein the process will just be uh, ramifying the branches, not any more thickening. So in this case, this is this will be its uh, figure or its form as of today. See, we are in the process of building a uh, branch structure, so so we do not cut those branches which we would like to thicken first. Okay, and at the same time we're already shaping because as this uh, branches will uh, thicken and we wire them now so that hopefully we are able to to shape them already. Okay, so this branch may not even be needed, but I'm still uh, leaving this as is so that hopefully they will be. I can remove this actually, but for now, this will help thicken this main trunk. So that's a 260. Now we are going to put a larger pot. Put this into a larger pot so that the roots can grow uh, bigger and thus also grow this uh, branches thicker. Then we can do these are uh, really fertilizers. So. We need to loosen up the roots so that it can it can spread instead of just turning around. So na ayon kaya kaniya ra makilid nga maka. Okay, this is its position and we are tying the plant, the string, not so tight though, just enough to snag it and the roots are already spread. So we're going now, we are now going to add soil. And the last one will be watering and then 
This will have to go into the shade for about for about a week. And hopefully by then the roots would have uh, re-established and and then this goes to the sun. And maybe after uh, two months we will fertilize this. Thanks for watching.